An aircraft carrier is a warship that serves as a seagoing air base, equipped with a full-length flight deck and facilities for carrying, arming, deploying, and recovering aircraft typically, it is the capital ship of a fleet, as it allows a naval force to project air power worldwide without depending on local bases for staging aircraft operations. Carriers have evolved since their inception in the early 20th century from wooden vessels used to deploy balloons to nuclear-powered warships that carry numerous fighters, strike aircraft, helicopters, and other types of aircraft. While heavier aircraft such as fixed-wing gunships and bombers have been launched from aircraft carriers, these aircraft have not successfully landed on a carrier. By its diplomatic and tactical power, its mobility, its autonomy and the variety of its means, the aircraft carrier is often the centerpiece of modern combat fleets. Tactically or even strategically, it replaced the battleship in the role of flagship of a fleet. One of its great advantages is that, by sailing in international waters, it does not interfere with any territorial sovereignty and thus obviates the need for overflight authorizations from third-party countries, reduces the times and transit distances of aircraft and therefore significantly increase the time of availability on the combat zone. Chart comparing a selection of aircraft carriers sorted by length there is no single definition of an aircraft carrier and modern navies use several variants of the type. These variants are sometimes categorized as subtypes of aircraft carriers, and sometimes as distinct types of naval aviation capable ships. Aircraft carriers may be classified according to the type of aircraft they carry and their operational assignments. As of August 2022, there are 47 active aircraft carriers in the world operated by 14 navies. The United States Navy has 11 large nuclear-powered fleet carriers carrying around 80 fighters each the largest carriers in the world. The total combined deck space is over twice that of all other nations combined as well as the aircraft carrier fleet. The U.S. Navy has nine amphibious assault ships used primarily for helicopters, although these also each carry up to 20 vertical or short takeoff and landing fighter jets and are similar in size to medium-sized fleet carriers. The United Kingdom and China each operate two aircraft carriers. France, India, and Russia each operate a single aircraft carrier with a capacity of 30 to 60 fighter jets. Italy operates two light fleet carriers and Spain operates one. Helicopter carriers are operated by Japan, two of which are being converted to operate fighters. France, Australia, Egypt, South Korea, China, Thailand, Brazil. Future aircraft carriers are under construction or in planning by Brazil, China, France, India, Russia, South Korea, Turkey and the US. A fleet carrier is intended to operate with the main fleet and usually provides an offensive capability. These are the largest carriers capable of fast speeds. By comparison, escort carriers were developed to provide defense for convoys of ships. They were smaller and slower with lower numbers of aircraft carried. Most were built from mercantile hulls or, in the case of merchant aircraft carriers, were bulk cargo ships with a flight deck added on top. Light aircraft carriers were fast enough to operate with the main fleet but of smaller size with reduced aircraft capacity. The Soviet aircraft carrier Admiral Kuznetsov was termed a heavy aircraft carrying cruiser. This was primarily a legal construct to avoid the limitations of the Montreux Convention preventing aircraft carriers transiting the Turkish Straits between the Soviet Black Sea bases and the Mediterranean Sea. These ships, while sized in the range of large fleet carriers, were designed to deploy alone or with escorts. In addition to supporting fighter aircraft and helicopters, they provide both strong defensive weaponry and heavy offensive missiles equivalent to a guided missile cruiser.